Hey yo pretty people, my name is Lexpent, welcome back to Stalker Shadow of Chernobyl My favorite game of, well, not all time, but to a certain degree <laughs> So, in the previous episode we battled the first controller on the, of the game uh, that we met in here, in the catacombs We found Strelok's stash and the hideout of his group and frankly I, have, I had no idea how to top this So. Today we will be stealing that stupid case uh, with documents and uh, from the agroprom and this is we are basically about to experience me at my most tactical -est. especially since I have a proper uh, plan of the base and seeing how this is me at my most tactical -est, est I think it's time this is where we officially surrender the whole Marked one thing because guys marked one uh, the the main character of this game uh, throughout the series becomes one of the most legendary stalkers ever and since I'm obviously not that good at the game I will be from now on assuming a different role in this development a role of a completely different character not marked one but a Markedon mm -hmm. Marked Markedoni. Markedoni is a drunk bum who just, yeah, randomly was picked up by the stalker in the beginning instead of the actual marked one. So everything thinks that I'm the marked one and in fact I'm not him. I'm just a random bum uh, running around killing people with a knife, like halfway hungover and halfway drunk. And that's how we're gonna approach this particular mission. So get ready. Oh my god, this is the greatest movie I've seen in my life! No, I'm just kidding, but yeah, let's proceed. Alright, so what do we know about the conundrum of this situation in the diary? <laughs> we are here, and they are here, here, ev and everywhere. Which is why we shall be doing basically this. We shall run here, then here, then here. And we will be entering the house from the back. I'm not sure that it's gonna work out. And actually, now that I think about it, here we have three snapper people. Here we have another snapper guy. Meanwhile, here we only have two guys and another one guy. So if we just run here, we are most, much more probable to survive. Basically, the goal here is to get on this side of the building. So let me quickly just ponder for, for a second there. Okay, there's a patrol guy. He's coming into the patrol thing. Oh crap, 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 crap. Well, the element of surprise is lost, which I, I hear is the first stage of any operation ultimately. Cue the Zoidberg noises! And okay, and oh crap, the fire ladder is off. Um, 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 uh, get in here, get in here and... Hide! I'm not here. Nobody knows. And the ones who know shall not tell. Okay. I doubt the. I hope they didn't hear this. <laughs> yeah, once again, this is me at my most tactical last test of. as possible. Where you at? Where you. Ah, they'll never find me in here. Yeah, sure. Um, yeah, funny enough, I actually understand what they're saying, and what they just said is kill him if he shows up. Which, frankly, I plan to show up, and this is the uh, second story. The case is on the third one. Okay, okay. Shut up! Don't don't interrupt me. I'm trying to think in English right now. You, you're making me constantly, constantly switch between the two languages. That's you don't know how annoying that is. Although you guys probably know Ukrainian. So yeah, keep shooting the wall, man. It's fine. Keep shooting the wall. It's it, it's okay. That's totally gonna work out for everybody. Is there a fourth level? No, there isn't. But I'm guessing that there, there should be... Yeah. And while I'm at here, add it. 
that. <laughs> Sorry, it was bugging me. Okay, so here we'll be basically passing them by. Sneaky. So, does this army recruit anyone but morons at all? Or do you guys just, you know... I mean, technically, it's those are the drafted people, so... Basically, people ripped away from the, their homes for no reason, for only for the crime of being a guy. And also mentally healthy. Part one. I told Barkeep about you. He should talk to duty guys to let you from. I suggest you go see him fast. <laughs> okay, first, my actual name is Makedoni. And... Second... Yeah, sure. <laughs> Crap my pants. Yeah, we'll have to get rid of this particular suit of armor. Because this one is now dirty. And there are helicopters. That is amazing. Helicopters. Men's, men's natural enemy. Okay. Okay, easy peasy. No one's noticing us. We shall yoink. Okay. And now we just skedaddle through that hole in the wall. Save and. Would you look at that? It actually worked out. Huh. For everybody in walls except, you know, the dead guys. Um, and there's this. Yay! Celebrate good times! Come on! <laughs> no 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 no! You so, okay? Fine, 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 fine. Everything's fine. It's, it's okay. It's okay. We're, we're done. Now all we need to do is get out of here. And next destination of ours is this: the bar, uh, the bar location, which is under con the control of the group uh, group called uh, Duty. Which, I'm guessing they are not duty free, so... You know what, guys? You screw you, I'm going home. Yeah, really, you guys don't know how much I appreciate that this mission actually kinda has a stealth option. <laughs> because I, at this point, I'm fairly tired of killing guys. Alrighty, once more we're at the garbage area, and we need to get here, obviously. And to go to the bar, which is once again the territory under the uh, duties control. Also, upon re-entering the location, we got a mission to kill off these guys. A group of can come to visit. Yada yada. <laughs> we need to secure and protect. And uh, I'm guessing that there's a bunch of bandits just randomly spawned on our way there. Well then, shall we? Oh, I actually don't have any grenades. Okay. It's kind of funny how these guys are basically there to demonstrate uh, the player just how stronger he became by robbing a bunch of bandits off of their precious uh, materials. Which, yeah, true be told, it's less about robbing, robbing a bunch of army people uh, from their materials and more about ransacking uh, Strelok's stash. Uh, of his uh, and in, in his group's hideout. Hi! Wow, you guys are terrible shots. Okay, but yeah, as I already told you guys, uh, once you get the 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 proper weaponry, it's so much easier to kill people. Well, not morally, my, uh, of course, but you know, just. Yeah, shut up, guys. I'm I'm already looting. The fight is over. I won. Actually, to think about it. Actually, to think about it, every here, every now and again, you are actually interested in just the enemies winning because then I then then you get to loot your fellow stalkers' corpses. And at the same time, meh. It's okay. Our fellow stalkers' corpses rarely have anything of use on them. Yeah. This is where you like realize, oh, that's why 
uh, most of the modifications actually make your make the game uh, way 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 harder because uh, it's not necessarily a walk in the park. I personally can still die because I suck at this, but I'm guessing a skilled player wouldn't have any trouble right here right now. Although right now I need to admit that I only have nine bullets in my gun, and apparently it's probably from me just not ransacking people enough. So let's go uh, grab a shotgun from somebody's corpse, because they should ha should have some. Okay, there we go. We have plenty of shell uh, ammo, but we also have not used this gun for like forever. So it has been a while. And I'm not that good at, uh, again, tactician stuff. What's this sound? Oh, that's just anomalies. It's fine. Funny enough how you get um, acquainted with anomalies and absolutely like not afraid of them after a certain amount of time. Also funny enough how I have 37 uh, bandages. Yeah. Not quite. Uh, on one run of the game, uh, I remember at the end of the game just w uh, finding that I'm constantly overloaded despite not having that much of anything in my inventory. And that's when I realized that I've been carrying around half a thousand bandages on me that I just picked up from everybody else's corpses. Attention everyone, this is Duty Outpost at the Garbage. A horde of mutants is advancing from the Dark Valley towards the bar. Whoever helps us push back the scum won't regret it. Duty word. Okay, and this is our first encounter with the duty group, who are... I have to admit... Jocks. Just... In general. Particularly because... Yeah, because of that. You see, they are actually pretty successful at uh, devastating the hordes of mutants. Their entire ideology of their group is that zone as a whole and yeah, and all the mutants shall be destroyed and uh, eradicated. And they're really good at it too. My problem with them is that they are also ungrateful bastards who think that this, off, they are basically we don't ruling let every the thing. Buzz off, stalker. We don't let every loser go through. Are you gonna say the words too? No? You're not a part of their a cappella duet? Whatever. Um, Hold, stalker! You can't go any further. Why? Because that's our territory. Duty territory. And, heh, <laughs> you said duty. And we're very picky about who we let through in our, into our base. If you don't have anything important to discuss with you, our leaders, you ain't getting past here. I need to pass, I have some business with the barkeep. Yes, barkeep told us about you. See, this is all it gets to convince the, convince the guy. Uh, you can pass, say hi to barkeep from me when you see him. Oh, and don't forget, there are lots of anom anomalies on the way, so be careful. Tell me, tell me something. Well, I'm not really... Okay, whatever. Fine. Let's go meet the barkeep. Or we could ransack all the stashes I have in the... No, screw it. And welcome to the territory of the duty. Not fond of these guys, true be told. But they are running the place and sadly we'll have to deal with them. Hi, man. I, I see you didn't make it. Oh, well. Uh, so, what's happening in here? Dogs, mostly. Well, that was eventful. Any of you guys actually feel like attacking me, or did you just... Do you just like to gallop at everybody who has a gun? Does that kind of stupid tactic to, uh, to use? Yeah. There is this... There is this area of... Base of dogs, basically. Right next to, right next to the bar territory, who these guys are constantly, uh, constantly holding down. Hey man, what's up? Um, there was a uh, go on, keep moving. What are you staring at? There was a massacre on the outpost. What happened? Uh, 
Thus the last wa wave of mutants that came before the blowout. It's quite for free or for death and then there's another wave. It's not for us, there'll be if it's not for us, there'll be no bar, there'll be no duty. We're the last barrier in the way of these crazy mutants. A lot of our boys meet their uh, met their end here. Okay. Not entitled at all, you guys. Not also incredibly humble too. So yeah, you get my point. I mean, they are doing good uh, good work when you really think about it, but not necessarily. Also, uh, dog uh, dog territory duty territory. Um, if uh, basically this sign says that if you are if you are attempt to use your weapon in here, you'll get shot. So that's a thing. Get out of here, stalker. Get out of here, stalker. And this moron keeps uh, saying the same thing over and over the longer you stand there. So. I, I'm always happy to to. So here it is. Bar hundred rad. Let's see what they have to say for themselves. Um, this is where we meet the second uh, big trader of the game and of the lore. Really? Come in. Don't stand there. Okay, okay. Seriously, man. What's up with all the people in here not being happy about visitors? Hi. Hey, Mark. Have you brought the documents from the institute? Mmm, here are the documents from the Institute. Great work, Mark One. We have the documents at last. I need to have a look at them now. And maybe I'll work out how to get north. While I do that, how if you have problems this? with money, you can fight at the arena. The owner of the arena is Argus. I've uploaded his coordinates. Yeah, well, I'm gonna go to the arena, guys. Sorry, it's just a shootout after a shootout. And really, it was, it is fun for someone who's like playing the game over and over or like just messing around in the game uh, I'm here for the let's play <laughs> I'm here okay, for the story the document you brought from the Institute makes some things a little clearer but we're still missing the info we need to get a full picture a lead designated x18 is mentioned and its description matches the abandoned underground vaults in the dark valley looks like you have to go there and get the info we need the lab is closed and you need two electronic keys to get inside. I'll give you one, but you'll need to get the other one from Bull, the Dark Valley. Yeah, Bull is quite a character too. All you have to do is acquire the second key to Lab X18, get inside, and retrieve the second batch of documents. Don't forget to get yourself a protective suit, or you won't have a chance in hell getting to the lab. So. Do it. Yeah, let's do it. Good, I'll do it. And uh, yeah, that's the ginormous mission about the Agroprom done. We have some guys in here who will also offer missions, but I am hesitant to get uh, to any of them just because I will just fail them because uh, most of them actually have these missions uh, have this mission take place in areas not unlocked by me yet. Okay, let's see what we've had explained to us just yet. This is the Dark uh, Wally, and uh, there are three main locations in it. Uh, this is the lab entrance location, which is taken by bandits, and this is the main bandit base of this part of the zone. This is where we need to go to kill Borov and get hi Bor, sorry, in, in Russian his name is Borov, which is the same word, just you know, translated. So this is where Bor is hi hiding out, and this is where we, we will need to steal the key, f the second key from. Also, also, we are currently here in the bar, which yeah, delightful, and that's the arena. Okay, sounds fun. Actually, I'm quite looking forward to. Uh, Entering the, uh, what you call it? The, <laughs> the lab in the Black Valley, just because it is, it is a delightful location. It is just amazing stuff. I feel that this game is best when you are in catacombs fighting mutants, not where, not when you just run back and forth killing people. But yeah, that's the thing here. 
I've always got something interesting for people like you. Oh, and then this guy. He's the informa information guy. He will be willing to sell you stuff about basically Strelok and his groups and that stuff. But here's the thing, at this point, My since we did all the well missions properly, you, this guy has nothing new to offer us. So, that's a thing. Um, I'm here for the job. Oh, and we, we completed the camp defense thing, so that was delightful. Okay, I need a job to have something for me, I killed the soldier when I'm doing that. That is actually the mission that gets you to the soldier that uh, gave me the map of the agroprom. Thing. Eliminate the bad bandits at the garbage. I'm um, not in for it. Up then Flash's eye. Flash is that pig looking mutant. Not the actual pigs, not the not the not the boars that I just I've been just fighting, but uh the giant chunk of meat on four legs. Find the meat chunk artifact. That's that's up for me. I'm up for it. And I'm here for the job. And uh anything else? Night star, no, I cannot do that. Alright, 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 alright. What shall we do? Well, first of all. We can, in theory, buy a new uh, Obokan assault <laughs> rifle. It I uses the same armor as the fast shooting AKM, but uh, fast shooting AKM is basically a custom weapon, while Obokans are something that real regular army guys are running, running back and forth with. We already got a stalker suit, which is sadly the best one we can afford right now, or we can buy right now because obviously and it's not like we need anything so let's just sell stuff that I don't really need and see about it um, yeah this looks about right this is this is all this all all the artifacts we don't really need and I'll keep the new suit while selling the old one uh, also this gun whatever I don't need it I don't want it yeah, looks like we got it covered, really. Uh, I might buy some more vodka just before my bum beats, but no, that doesn't feel like, doesn't feel right. Um, should I get an Obakan just to save myself the trouble of getting one? Because dealing with bandits using it, can, it's kind of better, and I'm pretty sure that the regular Obakan is still better than even a fast shooting AKM. Ah, uh, screw it. I mean, I have literally any nothing else except Silver maybe this gun. Yeah, and let's buy this gun too. <laughs> Whatever. Um, boop. And we'll sell this gun that uh, Wolf gave us far uh, quite some time ago. We'll sell this gun just for funsies, and I feel I will stash my thing in here. There are modifications for Stalker, I'm pretty sure, where your stashes can be robbed. But not this one. This one is actually okay. Sure. With this and this and that, we're basically good to go, right? Whoa! Oh! oh whoa! Oh, oh, oh! Radioactive! Radioactive! Yeah, this is the part of the game that is fairly dense with stuff happening. Oh, watch my bullet blow your brains out! Please, please don't kill me. Your partner is being taken to the abandoned factory. That's Slightly to the right know, there. I swear. Like, okay, scum. Okay. You can live. Just don't let me see you ever again. Hey man, come up here. Help us grab our friend from these bastards. <laughs> Follow me. I know a good place for an ambush. I'll thank you for your help. A duty. We always pay our debts. Yeah, you say that. But the one time I actually did something with the duty, not ended, ended up not being paid for it. <laughs> but whatever. <laughs> I'm just here, kind of giggling at the way at the voice they gave him in the English translation. Of course, the Russian version of the game has them all speaking proper Russian and uh, always with, with no accent because the game was made for Ukra by Ukrainian people. The funniest bit is that, like. Yeah, most of the NPCs speak in English. In this voiceover, to a Russian, uh, to a Russian person, sound like a bunch of Russian people trying to specifically speak English to this one guy because they need him to understand them. Basically, this is the accent the Russian people, not really skilled in English, get when they're talking English to just a foreigner that in the middle of it. Yeah. It very much still feels like the entire zone speaks Russian while the main character is just not in on the joke. <laughs> Literally, 
Especially when they're telling anecdotes at the, at the campfire. But yeah, we need to rescue the duty here! <laughs> That's a, such a stupid word. But yeah, the guy from the duty needs to be rescued. And uh, we're saving here because this can go so wrong so fast. You have no idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> This is also one of the frustration missions, uh, frustrating missions, because this, these guys take their sweet time getting here. And also they can randomly decide that they spotted you. See? Like this. Okay, screw it. Uh, run, man! Run! I'll cover you! With a blanket or something! Uh, oh, crap, crap, crap! Game, if you would stop lagging in such crucial moments, I would appreciate it. Okay, task complete, free the duty here. <laughs> that is the dumbest word. I don't know, it might make sense. Because, like, it's a guy who's from duty. Thanks, bro. Come over. We'll talk. Thanks, bro. Come over. We'll talk. It is it is not like insincere absolute. It is absolutely insincere for me to make fun of voice actors considering I I have my own weird ass accent as a Russian person who doesn't have English as his main language. Thanks, you got my partner out of your here like this. It's from the bottom of my heart. Why do you store money in your heart? That's not sanitary. I guess you must uh, know the area well. What's interesting here? Well, I already told the viewers that. Do the two of you were on the scouting raid? There was another guy. So the three of you were on the scouting raid. Three for crying out loud. I don't know he's gone and I haven't heard from him. The gun must have dealt with him after all. Uh, I guess you must know this area. Okay. Um, yeah, the funniest bit is that there are four people in this area who are not bandits. These two, the third guy, Siroga, and there is a fourth character. Uh, actually, there are five non-bandit people. In here, uh, the fifth one is in the in one of the. Oh my god, this the this part of map is just has all trouble loading in. Uh, but yeah, there is a f fifth guy, and we'll visit him right now. Since uh, yeah, <coughs> sorry, I might be a tiny bit like making noises with my mouth. I apologize if I am. It's just that one of my teeth is. On the fritz, and I instinct like I keep uh, instinctively checking it uh, with, with with my tongue. I, I I'm trying not to, and I know that it's annoying, so I apologize if I do. But anyway, yeah, let's let's go check out if they if the guy is in here, because you can see him on the map. And if I would say that there is a reason why he's here, that would be a lie. Yeah, yeah, I can hear you, dude. Scream louder. Yep. That noise was awfully familiar, wasn't it? Congratulations! Trying to save your sorry ass, and you're dead. Oh, you, you. Here you are. Ah. Uh... Yeah, here you are. Вот так и загнёшься. Не за хвост собачий. Do you have any info I could have? Um, uh, you bail me out for real. Uh, if I live long enough to see you again, I'll try to pay you back. Right now, all I can spare is a juicy tip. Okay, so the south of here, there's a farm where some easygoing stalkers set up camp. One of them is selling a ghost rifle, uh, real cheap, just 800. I was going to buy it and then uh, got knee deep and yeah, so. This guy's an idiot. Just spoiler a lot. This guy's an idiot and his tips are crap. So we basically wasted all uh, all of our remaining bullets of our rifle. Well, of our assault rifle. On something completely optional and unnecessary. Uh, and this is where we have to go infiltrate the camp. Okay, let's see if the, if there's a peaceful approach. Hey guys! Well, this went terribly. You have. 
Okay, at the very least I got bullets for this gun, so let's see if I can pistol them. Take it from the lab from Borrow. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill it, guys! Seriously, and see, there was the last, uh, the fourth member of their uh, little duty gun. Okay, let's try and do this on the light. Maybe we can just run, run off into here and still get not killed. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you guys keep looking for me. I meanwhile will be totally not trying to kill your boss. Okay. Then again, maybe they're, maybe they're fine with people killing their boss. Hi. Okay, this guy is surprisingly uh, good at scaling stairs. Anybody in here? Anybody in here? So... Behind this? No, not behind the table. Okay, 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 okay. This being the bandits, bandit la uh, not not lager, that's Russian bandit camp. They actually have a stash of ammo somewhere in it, kind of preparing you for the boss battle. But before you get to it, you have to go through so many guys. It's ridiculous. It is impressive that so many, so many people can be. Yeah, there we go. It is impressive that in this game about uh, several, like, the several chosen few who can actually get uh, uh, by and survive in the zone, there are so many bandits in the camp that you can kill and uh, that will be easily replaced by, uh, by their fellow guys. Here we go. Okay, 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 okay. Where did I go the last time? Because I actually quite liked that route. Do you have a... someone talking who's talking who's talking while I, I'm trying to kill everybody I'm trying I'm, I'm, I'm beginning to, s to think that you guys aren't taking it seriously okay this guy sucked up a bunch of bullets um, <laughs> we can go there and we can go in here and I much rather prefer we go in here not not in there but you know in here I'm trying to be I'm beginning to believe that I should probably hit him in the head not in the center of his mass but whatever Man, my pea shooter is really not giving me, not making me any favors. Yeah, right. They're swearing at me like crazy. I'll have you know. I mean, in Russian, but still. If you ever wanted to to learn a bunch of Russian swear words, this is the game for you. And this is also the level for you, because it's the bandits that swear the most. Ah. And I'm about to start too, so... So, the problem that I have uh, presented myself with right now is basically that right now I'm kind of surrounded. Uh, I have enemies behind me, I have en enemies in front of me, and uh, yeah, neither... Do, uh, neither they nor the other ones want to uh, let me be. So I do have the upper hand in that I actually know where I'm supposed to go. To a degree, this is one of the more uh, more confusing locations of the game, just layout-wise, and uh, it is quite frustrating to navigate, really. But I do know that the guy from the duty that I have to save is in the... There we go. In the... Uh, whatchamacallit? In the basement. And I also do know that their boss guy is somewhere that way. So let's... 
let's try dealing with that then, okay? You know, I should really just start killing these guys more efficiently. Another problem entirely is that I have no idea how entertaining you guys are finding this shootout. Because I know for a fact that this game kind of likes it, its gunplay a tiny bit too much for my personal taste. But hey, who am I to criticize? Uh, because frankly, I'm enjoying this to a certain degree too. I would be enjoying this to a certain degree uh, way more if I had more bullets for this particular gun. Or if I decide, uh, or if I actually went about this a tiny bit smarter. Hi. Thank you. Um. Anyone else? Yeah. Basically, I'm currently uh, being saved just by the presence of enough resources and enough uh, med kits for me to soak up as many bullets as possible. I'm just here, I'm still here because I'm durable, not because I am good at shooting at all. Really, in a perfect world you would probably want to er eradicate all the enemies uh, gradually as you progress, but hey, you know me, I don't do things the proper way. Okay, there, there's been another guy somewhere in here, where is he? Where did you go, you jock? Oh, there you Okay, doing some progress. Seven around, the, uh, seven before every corner. Hi. Yeah, this is where stuff ta gets tiny bit, tiny bit. Okay, task file fail the item. It find the item. That doesn't matter. We actually threw out that particular suit ages ago. And there you have it, that's the boss of all of the bandits, just killed, with no problem at all. <laughs> uh, this game is stupid sometimes. But yeah, we got rid of him, that's what, ha that's, that's what matters. Do you have the key on you? No, you don't, but I apparently got it still. And here's another stupidest thing about it. This guy has this, these lockers that are technically locked, but you still can get stuff through them so that makes all sorts of no sense yeah now next task up is we need to go find the other dog guy the other duty guy who is somewhere in the basement and also I do remember that there is somewhere in here somewhere oh hi 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 I'm sorry I already killed your boss yeah you are jobless you can go home now Thank you. And I'm pretty sure that this is where the stash is. Judging by the uh, unnecessary amount of guards, basically. Wa uh, Walker of the month, people. This guy couldn't figure out how to open the door, which, again. And now we're getting shot at by someone from above. Eh, whatever. Can deal with it. Um, anybody here? Nope, nobody here. Alright, so I'm assuming this is where they kind of sleep. Only kind of, because you can't really, truly, full on sleep on here. Okay, 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 okay. Is this the thing? Yeah, it is! It is, baby! I don't know why I'm talking to babies while uh, playing this game. And obviously, we're here for. All sorts of useful stuff. There are there are the grenades for the uh, for the special grenade launcher that is attached to the uh, to the assault rifles. There are, and yeah, here's the true reason why why we're here. I don't even care that I won't be able to carry all of this on me. This is way worth it, and I need to get rid of two kilos of something. So, the following programming is not approved by the Zlo XP channel, even though I'm the, the guy who's making stuff for that channel. <laughs> However, we do not condone the consumption of incredible amounts of 
any alcoholic su substances. However, screw it. This is a video game. Wow. You're telling me that the same people who programmed... Hi. Ooh, this is... This is, this is this is not as fun as I was hoping it would be. Um rata ta 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 Pew 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 Okay, aiming at this guy is obviously not 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 working. Let's try the conventional round Oh crap And oh almost Almost Okay, where, where is he? Where are you? Oh, shut up! Ah, almost! I almost got him! <laughs> okay. You know? 33 bottles. Half a kilo each. Meaning that we just downed 15 liters of pure vodka. <laughs> yeah. We'll just leave it to the end here. I'm fine with that. I, there's not enough radiation in this entire game to justify this amount. This amount of uh, radiation prevention tools. But I do find it hilarious that the same people who programmed that if you keep bugging people to chat with you while holding a gun, you actually get punched because they get pissed off at you. The same people failed to program a subroutine to kill you if you drink too much alcohol. And I say that knowing that in future installments, they actually did program it so uh, the way you actually die if you drank too much. Yeah, you know, somehow I keep failing to find the basement in, in this area. That is alarming. <gasps> Never mind, here it is. Hey, Stoker, help me out. Open the door to this damn cell. The controls are on the wall. No. <laughs> All right. Thanks, bro. You really helped me. Just for that piece of brilliant voice acting. Just that. Thanks, brother. I owe you on a uh, look uh, what I was able to find out. It might prove useful. Borov, uh, the one who calls the shots. Yeah. He's been sh calling too many shots re recently. Got one in his head. Has collected quite a lot of goodies. He's got a piece from, of the key. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, they got Yak and they said there sh used to be some kind of lab there. Thing is getting close to both of his... Yeah, thanks for the information. I knew all of it. I don't know why. Uh, you see, if the game actually had alternative routes to it, that would allow you to go to the... Uh, to the place without having to deal with barman, I would understand that. But since it doesn't, I'm just left confused, frankly, because, uh, yeah, it seems like... Oh, no, 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 that's, that's a wrong weapon to deal with the situation, Sloy. You cannot knife your way out of any, any debacle. Actually, you know what? Our goal here is to be... Oh. You, you <laughs> I almost shot the guy that I just saved. Um, our goal here is to get out of this area. And once we're done, we're done, basically. We will be able to go into the proper lab and do the lab stuff, which, once again, I find incredibly, infinitely more fun than shooting random bandit guys over and over. Uh, okay, and there we have it. And uh, if I'm doing this correctly, I should be able to jump down somewhere, let's say here, ow my ankles, 
and there's not even a god in here, so... Yay! We're out of here! Mission completed! Hurrah! Now to storm our way all the way to the thingy magic, and there's a storage somewhere in here, a, a hidey hidey spot. Where's the hidey hidey spot? Where's the hidey hidey thing? I, I don't get... Oh, there it is. And uh, let's see. Mm, crystal phone, minus 20, okay, that's fine. And some good patrons for my other gun. Okay, this has worked out, well, not perfectly, but fairly okay. I, I have to admit I died way, way more times in the, than I would appreciate, than I would like to. But, nevertheless, this is where I call it for today. I don't know how long this episode has uh, in, is uh, in the end, but in front of us uh, we have, like, in the, uh, in the next one we'll have to storm our way to the lab, uh, then to deal with all the monsters that we'll find inside, and then to, then to storm our way out of here, out of the lab. So that's a lot of shooting and I'm kind of sh all shot out for now. So thank you everybody so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, please do leave a like if you did, uh, please do subscribe if you uh, really liked it and want to see more. Uh, that's gonna be it for today, thank you everybody so much once again for watching, to be continued.